Hi, I'm Jason Wagner. I'm a regional sales manager here at eSwitch, and I'm here today to discuss the second step in our seven-step process for helping you define what switch you need for your application. The second step deals primarily with electrical ratings. Uh, the first item we'll discuss is voltage. So there are two types of voltage, AC and DC. Uh, the most common voltage levels in AC are the 125 and 250, or your typical line voltages. The most common voltages in DC are 3, 6, 12, and 24 volts. This can be important in helping you define your switch. AC circuits usually require a larger switch. DC circuits usually require a smaller switch. When we talk about switches, we talk about three main categories, low power, medium power, and high power. A low power switch would often be a, a tack switch or similar board level type device. These are usually no more than 20 to 100 milliamps at 20 to 30 volts DC. When we talk about medium power devices, we're also talking about board level products that are a little bit bigger or panel mount products. These are often two to five amps, up to 30 volts DC, and these can also be used with our AC voltages. When we talk about high power switches, we're talking about larger rockers, toggles, and push buttons. These can often go up to 20 amps and are typically only used with AC voltages. When we talk about high power circuits, it's important to mention safety certifications. In the US or North America, there is UL and CSA approvals. In Europe, we have ENEC or ENEC approvals, and Germany has their own called VDE. These are certification safety standards that are applied to high power applications only, so you won't see these certifications on the board level tax switch type products. Thank you for watching the video today. If you have any further questions, please visit our website, e-switch.com, or give us a call. We'll be happy to help.